One of the great classics of French cuisine, chicken chasseur, otherwise known as hunter style chicken, in 15 to 20 minutes. Very simple, chicken breast, shallots, chopped parsley, chopped tarragon, tomatoes, mushrooms, tomato juice with a little bit of gravy browning just for the colour, not necessary but it just gives it that richness. Butter, they have a bit of brandy and a little white wine and of course chicken stock pot. Take our chicken and we flour it. No need to season, the stock pot will do that for you. You may ask why I'm flouring it. One, it gives it that nice golden brown colour and secondly, just that little bit of flour assists with the thickening of the sauce. You can remove the skin if you wish, but I'll be very honest, I kind of like cooked skin. I place my chicken skin side down. Don't want it too hot, otherwise it'll scorch the flour straight away. By cooking it slowly, one, I get the caramelization assisted with the flour, but secondly, I'm rendering the fat within the skin, which then makes the skin palatable. Very few people these days flour their chicken. When I was a boy, when I started many years ago, chicken breasts were always floured before they were pan fried. And chicken chasseur was always a fricassee, it was cooked in a pan and the sauce made with it. As you can see how golden the chicken is becoming now. This is what the flour does. Take our finely chopped shallots, make some room for them, and so they go underneath. If I sprinkled them on, some of them wouldn't be cooked, they'd be raw. By pushing the chicken to the side, dropping them in the middle, and then allowing them to seep underneath. They're so fine, they take seconds. Now, the brandy again, when you deglaze anything with brandy, or alcohol, always around the edge of the pan. Because if you splash it over the chicken, the raw alcohol is staying on top of the chicken. Around the edge of the pan, it runs underneath. As you can see, I've turned it over, so therefore, by the time my chicken's cooked, it's cooked evenly on both sides. A little white wine. Again, around the outside, so there's no raw alcohol on the chicken. Tasting the wine, because I want the acidity to remove, so the natural sweetness and flavor of the wine comes through. So you can see our shallots, chicken juices, white wine and brandy have all reduced down now into a concentrate, it's quite syrupy. So what I'm going to add now is my chicken stock pot, just on the edge. And then I'm going to add my tomato juice. I'm just slowly bringing my sauce to the boil. So the stock pot has now dissolved into the liquid. You can see the richness. Very quick sauce, very easy. In the other pan, we'll prepare our garnish. In with our mushrooms. In with the parsley. In with your tomatoes. Diced tomatoes with the skin removed. Again, it's about taking out the water out of the mushrooms to intensify the flavor. And then a generous amount of tarragon in with the chicken. Sprinkle your garnish over. And just to finish with a sprinkling of parsley. And there we have it, chicken chasseur in 15 to 20 minutes. Very simple, foolproof.